So with that, I'd like to introduce the great-grandson who helped make this start in terms of the initial challenge by going through his grandmother's attic. Do you know, at the Irish American Archives Society, we're partial to people who go through their grandmother's attic. So if you haven't done it in your grandmother's attic, I encourage you to do so. Without further ado, I give you Kevin O'Toole. With all the speeches, I'm a little concerned the sculpture is going to reveal itself before we're ready. So since I'm neither a politician nor a lawyer, I'll be quick. Um, you know, I never dreamed several years ago when there was some first discussion about doing something to honor Johnny that all this would come to fruition. Um, I've had some really great experiences both here in Cleveland and in Ireland as well, and I'm both proud and honored to be a part of all of those. Um, I'd like to uh, thank three people today specifically. Um, the first is Margaret Lynch. Um, without her dedication and perseverance, uh, certainly this project wouldn't have happened. So thank you, Margaret. Um, I'd like to thank uh, my cousin Aaron for her help and support uh, the last couple years to help make this happen. So thank you, Aaron. And of course, I'd like to thank uh, Rowan Gillespie for his beautiful work. Um, not only for selecting this project as something that he'd like to work on, but for caring enough to learn who Johnny was, not just as a boxer, but as a, a member of the community and a family man, and incorporating all of that into his work and taking the time and diligence to do that. And I think the sculpture reflects that, and I think all of his work reflects that, and I think we're very lucky to have him work on this project. So thank you, Ron. Uh, and again, that's, that's all I want to say. So thank you for coming. <laughs> 